people and I'm back cooking again and last time I cooked a lot of you got confused that is what I was looking for can you see I can't see it I honestly seriously cannot see it but yeah that is the cow John cow John that is what I was looking for I went and bought one just to show you what I meant last time when I said cow gone I didn't know what it was called, but that what it's that's what it's called. So now, you, you know now. Now this is boiled rice. It's going to be boiled rice. Thing is, I didn't realise I'd run out of rice. So the only thing I can add, add as a substitute is Uncle Ben's. So uh, it said put in a pan, cook for two minutes no three minutes oh I don't know two or three minutes Ooh. so well when the rice needs adding I will cook it for two minutes on in 30, 30 millilitres of water I'm not sure what that is but my uh, cups work out in millilitres well the new ones do and it says to add yellow and green pepper. You won't believe I have to go to the bottom of my freezer for my green peppers. They were near the bottom. And I don't know about the camera, but I don't know if you can. I'm only five foot three. So you can imagine going down a freezer Ended up in the bottom, two little legs that up shouting out me out of the freezer. But no, I didn't. These were, well, I got these, they were near the bottom. So, and yes, they are out of the freezer, as I have said. So I'm going to let them cook. Um, it does say add salty and pepper, pepper. So let's go and get the salt because I don't know where it is. And that's going to be the salty and peppery I'm going to add. Scrape it off with that. Well, that can go in both doors. And I'll give that a mix of oh, pepper up my nose again. Uh, yeah, so give that chance to a bit more time to cook they are all well I'm not saying they're all unfrozen but they're all uncoupled as you could see I was putting them in they that were a couple together right there we are <laughs> it's the pepper up my nose that's making my nose twitch. Gonna give them a little longer to cook. It says to add a diced onion. onion. Oh god, this is frozen solid. Um, I'm gonna put some in. I don't know how much to put in. I'm gonna say pop 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 probably that is enough there's not, um, not much left just put it all in it's not as though you ain't got plenty of them in freezer cake because you have you've got loads in so yes just give it a little Oh, it's all gone quiet. Well, it's all gone quiet. Right. <laughs> and then it says to cook them for a little a while, and then it says to add the chicken. Now, I've got chicken cut up already. Well, it was already cut up when I bought it. So, yes, I don't have to cut it up. Yay. Well, it says chicken on the packet, so I should imagine 
that it's chicken. Why don't I just pour it all in and I've done with it. Oh dear. You can't see properly because uh, I ripped the packet. But you can see it says part of it says diced chicken breasts. Well them because they've been used for chicken. There we are. Now we've got to let them got to let all that cook a bit more, let the chicken let the chicken get cooking put that near the bottom as we can so the chicken gets cooked and the peppers don't get burnt so the chicken that's it to the bottom as far as to the bottom as possible so let's have a look at, oh and it did say somewhere along the line oh hold on it's a new one wait a minute then it says to add a teaspoon of turmeric well I don't know what no I'm coming out oh. but it smells a bit like peppier so it's probably I don't want to put too much in because like I said I've never tried it before well I haven't said it on this video but I haven't tried it before so in that case you only put a little bit in there we are so that's starting to starting to boil a bit get oh, get I don't know if you can hear me above that, but it's cooking. Most of the chicken is done. Uh, the next next thing is to add. I don't even know if you can see that. It's tomato sauce. -ish. And it's said to add about seven ounces it's about seven ounces in other words it needs to cover it quite down again mind you if you keep taking it off at ring it it's going to cool down isn't it silly girl so yes that's that's it so now it says to cook that for 20 minutes and I haven't got my phone on me but I'm going to turn it down to a low heat I don't want it boiling um, I mean boiling too much so that's six five four three put it on number three so I'll give that time to cook get the chicken um, chicken time to cook in everything so there we are I'll put the rice on but it's two minutes now it does say oh which ring is which they're both on three, so that, that's the top one, that's it. But it does actually say... <gasps> Shit, I'm going to fall off that bloody stuff. It does say to add it in here. Now, yes, I'm using all grain rice. But I think it's best way. And I'm going to give it all good mixed in now I can't see how this is called boil rice when it's fried that ring on yes well somebody's fried anyway 
God, it looks like it's evaporated. Not a worry. Not a worry at all. The chicken's looking really nice and brown. Oops. So I'm going to give that get a few more minutes to a few more minutes to warm up and cook through and everything perfect. Right, I think it's at its time. So what I'm going to do is, can you see? Oh, I have. Yes, you can. I've got a saucer out. And what I'm going to do is, I'm going to take a spoonful. Oh God, that's a bit too much. I'm going to take that and put it on this plate. Because that, that is your end product. Right, I'm a bit scared to do the taste test with the turmeric that's gone in it. But let's get a bit of it. Bit with the chicken. Oops, chicken. <laughs> I just put the spoon on top of the chicken and it sliced in half. So it's got to be done. So here goes the taste test. Very nice that. Right, case what click then? Uh case as it was nice, um even with the tum 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 turmeric in turmeric. Oh it's burning here. Got a burning sensation. Or it must be that turmeric. Um so yeah, case as it's nice. If you there's gonna be a link in the description to my merchandise. If you like what you see, please keep viewing me. If you want to give me a thumbs up, please do. If you want to... This was a recipe, by the way. If you want to leave a comment and a recipe, please feel free, the more the merrier. And if you haven't subscribed or you know someone who hasn't subscribed, get them subscribing. Get yourself subscribing. Get everybody subscribing. Thank you. Bye.